Good morning. Today I'm going to speak uh, about uh, uh, mergers and acquisition. Uh, this market in the in the last two years uh, shrinked uh, dramatically uh, due to the credit crunch, uh, which affected uh, the possibility to uh, use the uh, financial leverage. But we have to distinguish between uh, uh, mergers and acquisitions. Uh, actually, mergers can be in this uh, moment, particularly for the uh, medium-sized uh, companies, uh, an effective tool uh, in order to um, uh, gain uh, the proper scale to uh, attack uh, the international market first and uh, uh, second, in order to uh, uh, create uh, and find synergies, uh, reduce cost um, uh, and uh, create uh, um, a lean uh, organization. Well, what are the typical problems uh, in, uh, in this kind of uh, uh, operation, in this kind of activities? The, the typical problems are related to the uh, different cultures that have to merge within two companies uh, and this is a very very tough uh, uh, activity which requi requires a professional uh, work and advisory uh, and at least from 18 to 24 months uh, to get the people used to, uh, to a new hybridation, a new hybrid culture uh, between the two or more uh, companies that, that merge. The second aspect is uh, related to the governance. Uh, this is uh, a key initial point that uh, stop normally a lot of uh, uh, mergers uh, because uh, medium-sized company uh, medium companies are owned uh, usually by family uh, families uh, and therefore there is a lot of uh, emotional aspect related to the ownership of the company, the story, the history of the company, uh, the family ties uh, and therefore it's very difficult to find the compromises uh, um, to uh, cover the key positions uh, within the board of directors or within uh, the management of, uh, of the, the new uh, entity. Uh, once these uh, uh, obstacles uh, can be overcome, uh, the integration become the key the key point because uh, uh, finding the the, 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 the company uh, to merge is and uh, and realize the contract is one thing uh, to find an agreement around the table. Uh, executing it uh, is another is another is another thing. But what I can say is that uh, uh, nowadays, uh, uh, although I fully understand the uh, wish to, to keep the ownership and, uh, and the history of the companies, uh, a medium-sized company in the, in the international fast-moving market needs to grow. Uh, and, one uh, fast uh, uh, way to grow uh, in, a, in a powerful way, gaining intangibles, is the mergers, is the, uh, is the activity of uh, merging. Because you can get uh, new capabilities, new products, uh, uh, knowledge, uh, intellectual properties, uh, and this is a uh, particularly interesting when the, the two or more companies that uh, wish to, to merge uh, are uh, complementary uh, and there are not too many overlapping but on the other side uh, is a, a key, is essential uh, that uh, um, the two companies operate in the, in the same market and similar market in order that the differences uh, uh, are not too uh, too big eh, on one side and the overlapping on the other side is not too, uh, too big because it doesn't create the synergies. So what I can say is a difficult 
but I highly recommend to explore all the possibilities in the market to, uh, to merge with other operators in order to create new players with a scale to operate in the, in the market and hopefully win. Thank you.